This video demonstrates how to use Solis WL Data Logger for you. First check that the packing accessories are complete. Pass the cable through the claw and nut first. Then insert the cable into the sealing ring and compact with the jaws. Insert the RJ45 terminal into the port, and then tighten the nut. The COM port at the bottom of the inverter is used to connect the data logger. Connect the data logger to the COM port of the inverter. The DAT logger has an error-proof connection gap. The three lights are always on, which means it is working normally. Data loggers support two modes of communication. First connect the data logger to the router with a network cable, and you can connect to the internet normally. If you need to specify a fixed static IP for the data logger, please use a device that supports the internet to connect to the local area network where the data logger is located. Enter 10.10.100.254 in the browser address bar. Enter the default account, admin, and password, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and log in. Click the WAN port setting on the left to enter the network address setting page. Click static IP to switch to the static IP setting interface. Enter the IP address gateway. DNS server and other parameters that need to be specified, click save to save your settings. Connect your Wi-Fi and open the Solis Cloud. Click More Tools and select Wi-Fi Configuration. Scan the QR code on the data logger or manually enter the SN code. Click Next and select One Click Distribution. Confirm the Wi-Fi signal name and input your Wi-Fi password. Proceed to the next step according to the procedures showing on the screen. Long press the button on the data logger for 5 seconds to start the Wi-Fi configuration. Configuration succeeded. Create your power station. Click the plus in the upper right corner to create a power station. Fill in the information according to the prompts. Part with an asterisk is required. Add data logger after creation. Scan the QR code on the data logger or manually enter the SN code. Data logger configuration complete. After watching this video, please refer to the product manual for full installation instructions.